what's up guys welcome to our channel eTechnese in this video we will talk about how to fix the error which says cannot access network shared folder on windows 11 we will show you the method and the step you have to use to fix this problem so stay tuned and watch the complete video method 1 restore point in this method, you have to restore your Windows 11 PC to the back date when it was working perfectly fine. Click on Start. Type in here RSTIUI. You'll see this Run command. Click on Open. Click on Next. Here, click on Show More Restore Point. Afterwards, select the Restore Point as per the date and the timing when your Windows 11 PC was working correct. Select the restore point and click on scan for affected programs. Afterward, it will show you the information of the program and driver that will be deleted in this section. The program and driver that might be restored in this section. If you are satisfied with the results, click on close, select your restore point, click on next and restore your Windows 11 PC to the back date. Method 2 update windows 11 for to update the windows 11 click on start click on settings on the left hand side you will see windows update click on it and here you have to click on check for updates afterwards install the windows 11 update method 3 troubleshoot share folder for to troubleshoot share folder click on start Click on Settings, scroll it down, you will see Troubleshoot in here, click on it, click on Other Troubleshooters, scroll it down, you will see a shared folder information, click on Run and it will start detecting the problem and show you the option for to type the network location you want to access. Simply type the location, click on next and troubleshoot the problem. Method 4. Set network to private. For to set a network to private, if you are a Wi-Fi user, then simply click on the icon of your network. For an example, like this one. If you are connected to your Wi-Fi, simply click on it. You will see an option. If I'll connect it, then you will see an option which says properties like this one click on it and you will get this option like this simply select private and restart your pc and check if that help you to fix your problem method 5 network discovery here you have to change the network discovery if you are a wi-fi user then click on start Click on settings, click on network and internet. Here you will see a Wi Fi option. Click on it, scroll it down, you will see something like changed sharing option. Simply select that and it will open a window screen that I'm going to show you that how it looks like and what are the settings you have to change. But before that, I would like to tell you if you are an Ethernet user as I am, so you have to click on start, type in here, control, you will see control panel in here, click on open, click on network and internet, click on network sharing center. On the left hand side, you will see change advanced sharing settings, click on it. Here you'll see private option click on this arrow and you have to select these settings turn on network discovery turn on file and printer sharing this method apply for both wi-fi and ethernet user if you are a ethernet user then you can open this option by following this method if you are a wi-fi user you can open this option by following the same method or you can go with the setting option as well after changing the private settings you have to open this all network options and in here scroll it down change the option 
to turn off password protection sharing. Afterward, click on save. This setting you have to do in all of your computer so that it will not ask you for the password whenever you try to connect it. Restart your PC and check if that helped you to fix your problem. Method 6. Start trading services. Here you have to start some services. I will mention all of the services in the description. You can check the description. I would like to show you the four services that what are the overall thing you have to do. Click on start. Type in here services. Click on open. And here you have to search for the services. Simply select any of the services in here. Search for the four services as I have mentioned in the description. Type S and you have to find the name of SSDP discovery. You will see an option to start it in here if it's not running. And afterward do a right click, select properties. Click on start. Set the startup type to automatic and click on apply and OK. The same thing you have to do with the other sharing services. Method 7. File and printer sharing settings. Click on start. Click on settings. Click on privacy and security. Afterward, click on Windows security. Click on open Windows security. On the left hand side, you can see firewall and network protection. Click on it. Scroll it down. You will see this option allow an app through firewall. Click on it. Here you have to search for file and printer sharing option. Just scroll it down and you will find it file and printer sharing option. Check this option. Select this option to private and afterward click on OK. If it's showing it cannot change the setting, then you can click here change settings and you will able to change the setting. Simply select it and make sure you select private box and afterward click on OK and restart your PC. So these are the methods you have to use to fix the error which says cannot access network shared folder on Windows 11. Thanks for watching. Meet in the next video.